what's your governance protocol? Do you have governance tokens or how do you address that subject? So it's, it's really interesting because if you think about the, if you make a project that's a DAO, for example, mm -hmm. then you say, okay, we're going to have this part of the project and we're going to have a governance token, okay? We're really a blockchain. Mm -hmm. So Varus is a coin that is part of the security model, just like Bitcoin is part of the security model of the Bitcoin blockchain. Varus is part of the security model of the Varus blockchain. Mm -hmm. We do have voting supported in the protocol. And if we have disagreements on how to move forward in the community, we can certainly have votes, but the governance coin is in fact not a governance token. Mm -hmm. It would be Varus, the actual coin. Okay. And so, um, Identities, on the other hand, on the Varus protocol can launch currencies, can launch blockchains, and each of those could in fact represent a DAO, a company, a government, a person. And so in that case, I would say most likely the particular project that might create a currency, the particular project that might create another blockchain would define their own governance protocol. Because although we are really an infinitely scalable network of blockchains, um, we don't extract any tax or rent for any of the other blockchains or currencies running on the network. And we don't actually define how they determine that they want to do their governance. 